Hi everyone, a uh, quick video here to show you how to access this week's uh, science assignment, the chromatography model app in Amplify. Uh, I'm starting off with the rams.org website. I'm going to click on Clever. Once in Clever, I'm going to click on Amplify. Now, once I'm in Amplify, uh, I'm going to go to the hamburger menu here and I'm going to choose elementary student apps. And then from there, if I scroll down and choose modeling matter, I'm now in modeling matter, science practice tools. You can see there's some other things in here, but I'm going to focus on the, the science practice tools. We want number one here, the chromatography model. That will open up an app that looks like this. And this is where you're going to uh, show us a little bit about what you've learned about chromatography, properties of molecules, and how those affect how they uh, separate out. Uh, think about the FAM model, think about the chromatography we did in the classroom, think about all the different properties that we learned about molecules. And here you're going to do a virtual or a nanoscale version that we can actually see of how molecules separated out in the chromatography model. So you can see here the first thing you need to do is choose four symbols down here to represent the four items on the right hand side. So uh, let's say I'll choose this to be dye one, this to be dye two, maybe this for dye three, and maybe this will be my water molecule. So in the chromatography test that we did or the investigation that we did in class, if you remember, I had a strip of the food dye below the pencil line. So if I use my four symbols and make a mixture down here of, oops, sorry, I don't want that one, don't want that one, I want this one. And so, you know, maybe a little more of these, another of that, and maybe another one of these. Just making a mixture of my four symbols over here that I have for my mixture. And then we added the water, we submerged that in the water. And then the water started to take that food dye up through the chromatography paper and it started to separate out the different colors that were in the food dye mixture. So at this point, you're going to take your symbols and you're going to start placing them up through the chromatography paper on this app, how you think they would separate out based on everything you've learned from the chromatography investigation we did in class to the fan model that you watched on that video. So think about everything we've learned and think about how these would start to separate out where this particular dye molecule would end up, where this particular dye molecule would end up and where this one would end up, or whatever symbols you use. And then of course, think about the water as well, where it would end up on this paper. Once you're done with that, I want you to go back to Google Classroom. I have an answer key posted there. So check what you have against my answer key. Even if you don't use the same symbols, uh, you can still check against my answer key and then watch Mr. Turner's video on how to take a screenshot of your results and send those to me. Thanks for watching. Good luck.